Hey guys, it's Ricky. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different from the ranked highlights I usually show you guys. I'm going to be doing something more along the lines of my tips and tricks video. And I'm going to show you guys a couple angles on the maps, yacht, Hereford base, and plane. And depending on how well you guys uh, like this video or how well it gets received, I may or may not make another one. So it's really dependent on your guys' reaction. So let me know in the comments below uh, whether you liked it or not. And let me know by hitting that subscribe button. Or fuck, not subscribe. <laughs> the like button. If you can hit subscribe too. That'd be cool. But uh, just let me know what you guys think. Uh, enough bullshit. I can't really talk today. I sound stupid. So I'm just going to get into the video. Alright guys, so the first angle or line of sight I want to show you is here on Yacht. And an important thing to know is this third floor lounge is a very high traffic area, as I'm sure most of you guys know. You have a hatch here, you have another one behind this for uh, for kitchen, and I have the location in kitchen right now for the uh, objective, so that works out. Anyway, most of the time you're going to have a few people that try and break through either this door, the windows, whatever, and it's really, really good to hold down this room for the, the hatches. You don't want them to break in. So what you can do is you can come up to the cockpit or uh, fourth floor. And you're gonna go in the maps room and to the left of this bookshelf about right here you're on prone you're gonna throw some fucking punches at it you're on Kanye West that bitch and I mean, that's fine and now you have an amazing line of sight you can't see the other window but you can see this door great and you can see this window which is really good you have a lot of attackers that run up throw a punch at it break the window a little bit and then kind of peek back to try and get in and you can quick pop them which is really good and another thing that you can do is if you want you can actually impact nade this break off a little bit throw a few punches right here yeah that works and now and now well you're not gonna make you're not gonna make it this big guys but i'm fucking up and now if you want, you can get an angle on this window to the left, but you don't even, I don't know, I don't really feel the need to do that. And in all honesty, I don't even need to, need to impact it. No, you don't. Alright, I wasted, you don't need to impact it, but it's a great line of sight, everyone should know it, and it's, it's really useful. And now here's a clip. I put both targets. How many were they punched? They got a Yeah, 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 I got that angle. Oh, I see it. I see it. I got behind. Oh, yeah, I'll get him. Yeah, stun him. Stun him. Stun him. Oh, no, no, no. What? Oh. Okay, guys. So now we're over on Hereford base, and I have another angle. Obviously, because <laughs> why do I even make videos? I don't know. So you have this hatch over here, which I don't have reinforced because I already used my other two for a reason you'll see in a minute. But uh, everyone tries to come in with the boner thermite, and you want to get hatch open. It's 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 pretty essential to winning armory, and it's just a good thing to do. So with this window, a lot of people, a lot of people just pop out on the of that. But as attackers, they jump in, run in, whatever, hard get the hatch. So it's really, really good to get attackers before they can even come in this room. And how I do that, I do it two ways. This is the way I normally do it, and there's two downsides to it, but if you come here, you have a nasty, nasty angle, and you'd be very surprised as to how many people you can get with this line of sight. They don't really expect it, and you'll see in a few seconds a, a couple clips that I got with using that angle, and I use it a lot. But there's two downsides to it, and the one downside is pretty obvious, it's, it's this window. I mean, if you're a smart attacker, you can just spray through this shit, and I am out. I am running. But, <laughs> I don't, no one really does it. No one really gets me out of here, which is kind of funny. And the second downside is you can get droned out really easy. But if you can take out the drones before they see you, then you might have a chance to stay here. But if you can manage to kind of hide and just post up right here, I usually do it peeking right. You can get some nasty, nasty kills using this. Okay guys, so now I'm over here in Red Garage, and these are the two reinforcements I used that I uh, previously mentioned. And the reason I use these is pretty obvious, so they can't uh, sledge or breach into the wall behind you, as you're going to be standing about right here. So obviously, when you're standing here, you're going to have to pay attention to the window to your left, and people can shoot through to your right, but they're pretty pretty avoidable. You can hear, you can hear them coming, so I wouldn't worry too much. But what you're going to want to do is gonna want to come over and not this first one but the second one or I guess first one from the wall this long wooden uh, column you're gonna 
spray to the left of it or make a murder hole, kill hole, anything you need. Just make a small hole right here. And this works best with ACOG guys, but I'm using it. And you're going to come to the back left corner of this truck and you're just going to peek right. And you have great cover behind these sandbags. And I don't, sadly, I don't have any clips using this because uh, I'm a dumbass. You guys can blame me. I, de I deleted the clips where I got uh, a few kills using this angle. So you'll just have to take my word for it. But it's really good. No attacker expects it. And I hope you guys put it to use. Hey, I've been deep on that. I think she's already up here. But got one. Gonna... Oh, you got the carrier. Did they get hatched? Okay. No, they didn't get hacked with the beat bomb. The beat bomb is on the Got one. Op 4, last operator standing. That's your, That's he's outside, nice um, got one. Ash is yeah. gonna get a hatch. Oh, got one. Fuck, dude. I was just thinking about getting... Nah, wait, patch is going I'll get cams, bro. Sure. Alright. Got another one. Oh, dude, you got Hibana. They got Hibana. Reloading, cover good, me! Good. Hey Willie, there is Twitch in Alright guys, so for this last angler line of sight, we're gonna be on the map clean, and this is for holding down meeting room. Now, this one might be a little more common, as I've seen it on a, a Macy J video, I believe, so I'm by no means taking credit for this, but I just, I really don't see enough people using it, and before anyone comes at me, yes, I, I run barbed wire with the Egger, but you need a shield for this, so it's nice to have a teammate that uh, can put down a shield for you, but I'm running shield just so I can show you guys, so you or your teammate is going to come over here, and you're going to place the shield down right about right about in front of these little papers right here. Or I mean, not in front, a little bit behind. And now, you're going to literally just hold this angle. That's all you have to do. Now, I'll break down the door. So, once the door is broken down, and you peek, you have a really, really nasty line of sight right into the doorway and a lot of attackers yes they're gonna know you're behind here but it, a lot of them really think that they can peek you with this and nobody is going to be able to peek you and if they do i'm really sorry they got the best shot in the world because i have the only way i've ever been killed from this spot is one if they rush in and catch me by surprise and kill me here or if they break hatch you're gonna want hatch reinforced when you do this and barbed wire here always helps but i'll show you I'll show you what it looks like from the outside. If you come in, there is no way you're getting that first shot off. There is absolutely no way you're getting that first shot off. And you're going to see, actually before I roll the clip, I usually put a, uh, a Jaeger here. And I put another one here for good measure. I'm not going to do it. But and if you want to be real greedy, you can put your third one back here and protect yourself from hatch. But I usually, I usually run the Jaeger in a different spot, but that's just me. But uh, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to roll into the last clip now. And subscribe. Don't forget to like and stay tuned for more uh, daily upload. Not daily. Fuck. Dude, I really can't make videos. But uh, yeah, fuck it. I don't care. I'm leaving it in there. Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you guys uh, when I upload next. Take care, guys. It's been Ricky. See you next time. Sure. The server's Got one. Ash is right there, too. Get down Get down Get down To open up the walls. Got switch. Nope. Nope. Wait him, wait him, wait him. I saw the claim here, dude. Oh, I'm so dumb. Yo, like, you should look at this shit. Look at this shit. You shouldn't have even tried it. No. Reloading, cover me. Okay, so much pushed on. Got him down. Got him. Swapping max. Sledge, sledge down. Another injury. Boom. Oh, upstairs, upstairs, right. Right above you.